So here comes a pretty interesting part of the game. Well, first of all, we need to head to the castle for certain events and such. Okay, then comes a pretty interesting part of the game. Do do do. How's it going? I guess everyone's woken up and it's all good. No one really noticed they were sleeping or anything, but, you know, whatever, man. They just had a good nap, and... Where am I going? I gotta go to the... I gotta go this way. There we go. Need to get to the right floor, and my volume control is being stupid, and yeah. Smilin! Oh, it's you. Pfft, well, that's kind of rude. Hmm, what do you mean by that? That's so rude of you. It kind of is. Jeez, Ark. <laughs> you have the interview soon, right? Ark, you don't have to do anything. Oh, hey, I'll take that portrait. I have to remember those faces. Manga? Malin took the portrait. Are you sure it's okay? I don't know what you're up to, but be careful. I'm sure she'll be fine. Leave it to me. You better go, too. Alright, let's go. Let's do this, shall we? So you have found the cure for the princess's problem? Report to the king at once. I could do that. So, you found the means of curing the princess's problem. Then let us not waste time. Cure the princess at once. Fine. Eh, uh, what? What is this? What is happening? Don't, don't ask me, I didn't do it. L. L. Impossible! This can't be happening. They died years ago. Not just them. Everyone in this village. The lone survivor was this child, L. I know. I had them all killed. Pfft. Jerk. Your Highness, we are but a dream. We are not of this world. We came to awaken the eyes of El's soul. That is what you desire. Now, El, arouse the eyes of your soul. Let your father and mother hear your lively voice again. Father. Mother. Ah. Ah. I... No! The hell? Princess L, are you alright? Snap out of it. It appears the princess is not well today. Today's interviews are cancelled. You. You wait at the inn. Anyone, have this clown thrown out of here at once. I'm not a clown. What are you talking about? Well, that was, uh, something. Ark! <laughs> it looks like things went well. Did they? I don't know. But something looked odd. The king went totally pale. It's something in that girl's past. Did it really go well? I got chased out of there. No problem. Let's rest at the inn. I'm hungry. 
Alright, well. I guess that's all we can do now. Uh oh. What is this? Ark. Ark! Can you hear me? Hey, it's the Elder! The world of humans is still but in infancy. To make the infant walk and grow require humans called geniuses. Can you hear their voices? Voices imploring to be freed from darkness. Cross tall mountains and head south. I don't want to. There, a genius bearing a babe to the sea requires your help. Everyone requires my help. What are you talking about? I'm getting a weird feeling from you, dude. A anybody else getting a weird feeling? I don't know, man. I don't like it, but... A dream of the old timer... Ugh, what a start to the day. He said to head south. I don't want to head south. Or, was it just a dream? Or... I don't know, man, but... Regardless, we got work to do here still. Oh, it's you. Be careful if you're going out. The king died. <laughs> that was random. Like, what? They're claiming illness, but some are rumored he was killed. I guess the groom hunt is off now. Well, obviously. I mean, pretty much the whole kingdom hated him, so... I don't know, man. Mm. I can't eat anymore. Okay. So she's going to be sleeping for a while. So we have time to do stuff. And stuff and stuff and stuff. So now that the king's dead, this kingdom has the chance to grow. If you talk to this guy, he kind of always tells you what's going on. The king's death signals change. Growth depends on the new leader. When the doors to free economy are opened, the town can grow. This town's economic growth index is 0%. I say we finally start raising that index, you know? So let's come over here. Looks like Jean's hanging out. We will soon convene the meeting to decide upon our future. Participation by foreign people is invited as historical witnesses. Cool. Jean's giving a speech about the country's future. It's exciting. Kind of is. They're picking a new leader. What's the difference from the king? There's a difference, all right. The king sucked. It, it's terrible. The king has died. There's no more taxes and no more decrees. Hey. There's nothing wrong with that. Countrymen, as you know, the king no longer rules us. Without a ruler, we have gained an inalienable right to freedom. The time has come for all of us to move the country. I hereby declare my candid candidacy as the representative of the people. Naturally, anyone can become a candidate. Anyone else? I declare my candidacy also. What do we have here? Hey, it's Lewis. He's looking better. I'm not smart, but I love this village and country. I can help. Thank you, Lewis. You must now choose your representative. I would like to hold an election to determine your intentions. I would like to call for a recess to prepare for the election. We ask that you evaluate the candidates carefully before you vote. Yeah, okay. So yes, we get to participate in an election. The future is bright so long as there are those like Lewis. I would like to use taxes the king held to develop our town. Seems logical. By enabling more economic freedom, people should get better lives. 
What Jean had to say really struck a chord. Make people happy by helping make a better country. It's perfect. I disagree with Jean. Wealth without fulfillment is meaningless. We should all make and share what we need equally without favor. I, th I thought you liked what he had to say. What the hell, man? I'm totally going to vote for Gene. He's so intellectual. It's amazing that Lush Lewis would say something like that. The King's Death is springtime for Lore. Where's Princess L? I don't know. My grandma always said to me, Before you make a big decision, you should make a record of your tale. You should also pay heed to the opinion of specialists. Yeah, okay. So, you gotta make a choice of who you're gonna vote for. You can talk to him and he'll kind of give you the insider scoop. The future of the town will be decided by who is elected. If the conservative Lewis wins, the town will remain the unchanged. The unchanged? Okay. If the progressive gene becomes the leader, growth can be expected. When casting your invaluable vote, you should weigh the consequences. So basically, if you vote for Lewis, the town's not going to change. But if you vote for Gene, you can upgrade the town and such, so you definitely want to vote for Gene. Here we got a little thing. Hurry it up! Who did I vote? Gene, naturally. He's so okay, yeah. You have a thing for Gene, we know. Just think, this vote could decide the future of this country. Who should I vote for? Obviously, you definitely want to vote for Gene without question. I'm voting Gene. He looks well prepared and dependable. Indeed, he does. Okay. Voting has started already. The ballot box is over there. I would like to use taxes. The king. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, that's great. Calm down. Calm down, man. Voting, yeah, okay. Yeah, we get the cut of your jib, okay? We, we get it. Alright, I already voted, it's good stuff, okay. Wonder how lore will change, I'm excited. Yeah, 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 that's great. Okay, yeah. So, I, I like how you don't have to register to vote in this country, so that's nice. I'm not even from here, but I got to vote, and it's like, okay, whatever. And so, yeah, naturally, no, no, no matter what you vote for, the, the vote's going to be a tie. And you're going to be the deciding vote. So, I mean, of course it works out that way. So you just want to leave, leave into a building or the world map and then come back and see what happens. There's going to be a lot of that. Now the ballot is gone. So, thank you for your cooperation. We will now tabulate the ballots. Tabulation could take a while. Please return later. So again, you just want to leave and come back. Do do. As I go, I'm just gonna walk in and out of your house. No big deal. Sorry to keep you waiting. We wish to announce the election results. For myself, Gene, 25 votes. For Lewis, 24 votes, of course. For just one vote, I was elected the representative. However, I would like to ask Lewis for help in this difficult role. I also beg all of you for your support. Of course, man. Do, 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 do. And it's gone. Lore, led by the progressive Gene, can be expected to grow steadily. However, Gene will require time to build the town's foundations. This town's economic growth index is 20%. Nice. So now that Gene has been voted, this place can build and that it creates some side quests. But first, you have to wait until it builds up. What do you want? No one is allowed to enter into the castle. Be gone. So this is the tricky part. I'm not sure how you actually get it to build up. You just kind of have to wait, I guess. Sometimes it seems like if you like leave to other areas and come back, it'll do it. 
Because we can't do anything else until it upgrades. So, this game kind of likes a trolley in that way. We're gathering the opinions of people about this town's future. From now on, it's everyone's opinion that's going to shape this town. To be honest, I'm relieved. It could be better for the town this way. Yeah. Yeah, Jean's in. Lore's future's bright. Wonder how Lore will change. I'm excited. Yeah. Whoever wins will be chosen by the majority. Let's hope for the best. Okay, so yeah, I'm not sure how you actually get it to change. Like sometimes, yeah, like I said, sometimes it may maybe you just have to have a certain amount of time pass. I'm not sure. We may have to continue with the game before we can do anything else there. I'm not sure. Sometimes it seems like if you go somewhere else and come back, it just does it instantly, but I don't know, man. I don't know. 